Hey guys, back with another behind the scenes video of episode 21. And this is actually the backstage of the, <clears throat> uh, the theater stage set uh, in the main part of the episode, or one of the longest parts of the episode. Um, this is actually just, it's basically like, well, the backstage. It's, um, if you were to go out through there, it would be the front of the stage. Now, uh, a couple things I didn't change. In fact, I didn't even turn the blocks around. I kind of just moved one to the other, but you don't see this part in this part of the episode anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, and then I just put kind of like some, these are actually parts of, uh, like for the backgrounds and stuff that I kind of put back here to kind of signify, you know, actual backstage. Uh, it's not really, you can't really clearly tell that that's what that is, but um, it's like, that's what it's supposed to be. It's like the backgrounds that cycle through on this that are kept backstage. This is just to block um, more, like make a narrower space between backstage and front stage, or on stage rather. Um, for the red uh, curtain, um, I actually just flipped it around, so in the actual stage, this green part is over there and the blue part's over there, those are just clips to hold them together. Um, this part, which holds the backgrounds, uh, I did not switch, but I didn't need to, or, like I didn't flip it around, but it wasn't needed for this because uh, you only see like, you know, close-up parts of it like that and stuff. Um, as far as the rest of it goes, this is all just stuff to block out light. Um, and, you know, more of the stage. This would be like, the, you know, the front stage, like this is what you're gonna be sitting and watching. And oh look, it's backstage back there. Um, you need some more boxes to block some light and whatnot. So, yeah, that's pretty much as far as it goes uh, for backstage. It's nothing too crazy, but I knew it wasn't gonna be too complicated because backstage is uh, setless. Like there's nothing really to add backstage other than you know, props and stuff, but, you know, yeah. King Robin. And this time, it's the stage itself, not the backstage that I did last time. Or, if this goes up first, I don't know, whatever, I don't care. Um, so yeah, this is the stage part of the scene in episode 21, when they put on the play. Um, right off the bat, you're going to notice that the entire audience that they're supposed to be is not here. Uh, you might be asking, why is the audience not here? Why is there just a putty in Tails? Um, it's pretty simple, actually. It's because if I had the audience here, it'd be really difficult to get the characters to move because I had to reach over the entire audience to get these to move. And then uh, it'd also just be a waste of space. I had to zoom my camera like really far in to get to the shot because um, it'd be way deeper on the table. This is more up. And um, it just makes sense, really, because the audience is going to be shot on a different set entirely, for the most part. These buildings on the side, well, uh, where's the other part of that? Um, there's another, there's like the top to this. There's like two walls that will be here. Um, but uh, for the most part, it's going to be unnoticeable because this right here is like the set, and then you would turn around and see the audience looking at the set of the, uh, the stage. And sometimes there'll be a shot where it's like, over here, and then the audience member will be right here, and it'll, you know, it'll show the depth. But uh, for the most part, they're on two different planes. Now, as, as far as this set goes, uh, this is the first official, well, actually, no, the second official set in my show utilizing lamps. The first of which was the Radnick apartment. And I chose to do it on that uh, set for two reasons. One, because I had just gotten them, and I wanted to test them and see how they look. And two is because that set is supposed to be incomplete because they're, well, they just moved in, so it's supposed to look kind of different from the other places with, you know, good lighting or stuff like that. Um, you know, on the sides we have, well, it's pretty dark because I'm adjusted to this light, but we have like the uh, set backgrounds and stuff and, uh, you know, extra figures and tape, the tripod I'm recording or using to record with, and then right back here we have the backstage, which of course no one's back there right now because it'd be you know, irrelevant to have people back there, but, um, this kind of shows the connection between backstage and, uh, the actual stage itself. Um, as far as this part goes, it's not really going to be shown in the episode too much, at least I think so. I'm only so far into the script, I'm only at where Knuckles just comes in to Sonic at the very beginning of the play. Um, so yeah, 